It has become as much a part of the Thanksgiving tradition as turkey or cranberry sauce. We're talking about the annual teddy bear toss in Condors Town the Saturday after Thanksgiving every year. Well, there's no hockey right now, but you can still let the fur fly. Yes, you can. 23 ABC's Kristen Vartan joining us live from Mechanics Bank Arena with her friend and has details on this year's event. Kristen. <laughs> Henry, stop stealing the spotlight. Gosh, well, I guess he is the star of this show because fans will throw stuffed animals and teddy bears of all kinds onto the ice in Mechanics Banks Arena during the annual teddy bear toss. But this time around, you don't even have to leave your car to do so. It only takes one throw per person, but the Bakersfield Condors president Matt Riley says that over 21 years, their annual teddy bear toss has resulted in hundreds of thousands of stuffed animals reaching the arms of children just in time for Christmas. You'll see, you know, six foot tall teddy bears to, to, to six inch teddy bears and, and everything in between. Usually the teddy bear toss happens after the Condors score their first goal the game following Thanksgiving. Like the hockey season, it won't be the same, but the Condors and United Way are still committed to making sure kids still get the teddies right through the nonprofits they donate to. This has been a difficult year for everybody and uh, especially probably charities and uh, you know, to, if, if there's anything we can do, and our community always does great uh, by the by the nonprofits in the area. So, hopefully, we can be a conduit to to collecting a bunch of uh, stuffed animals for for kids. This time around, the teddy bear toss will be in the parking lot behind the Mechanics Bank Arena in the form of a drive-through this Saturday from 10 to 2 p.m. Bring more than one, and uh, you know, you can pack the whole family in the car. Uh, we're going to have it set up where you can throw out of both sides of your car. Riley says that they collect about 10,000 stuffed animals a year, and they're hoping to get just as many at the drive through. Plus, some players, coaches, and the Condors mascot will make an appearance to hold you over until the hockey season picks back up February 5th. We'll have information on our website, turn to 23.com on how you can donate ahead of time, or if you're a nonprofit and you want to benefit from this, then you can also check on our website. But Mike, I gotta ask you, I know that you're the Condors announcer, so I'd like to know how this event is special from your perspective in that booth. Uh, special is, is a very uh, interesting word choice uh, there. Yes, <laughs> sitting right on the ice for the past 16 years or so, I get to see a lot wow. of these animals up close, Kristen, because many people can't make the throw to the ice, so they end up in our mm. booth. So from the six foot bear to the six oh, inch really? bear. Yeah, we get clobbered <laughs> by bears every single year. That's it's, why you were making fun of me when I was throwing yes. my bear because I like tossed it right out instead of over. Okay, I'm not like a sports person, so I'm no, sorry no, no. about and that. And what would have happened, Kristen, was your bear would have ended up right on my head. Oh man, well at least it's plush. It's not gonna hurt you. So <laughs> it's Henry. We're gonna still throw for a good cause. Exactly. <laughs> it's Henry. Right. You Henry won't can hurt hang anybody. Out with us anytime. <laughs> Amazing. All right, Krista, thank you for that. Very good. All right, let's send things now over to Chief Meteorologist Elena Rusk for a look at uh, weather. And yeah, you're guilty as. as I as aim well. for you. I don't. I aim know for the you ice. do. <laughs> <laughs> I choose my seat accordingly <laughs> every year just sin. so there I can uh, be Mike with a teddy bear and then mm -hmm. donate to a good cause. It's for the kids. 